What's going on everybody? I just wanted to give you a quick review of my wade fish caddy that I did. I posted it on Salt Strong the other day. So with no further ado, let's get it on. Okay, so basically I have a weight fish caddy. I bought a boogie board. I painted everything. That way I could uh, have, every, have a nice uniform look. Uh, the first thing you'll notice is I have a measuring device. This is so I can catch those 30 inch snook guys and those 28 inch redfish. Um, I took a pool noodle and I basically went all the way around. I went all the way around the, uh, the board. Uh, for added stability um, If you guys come around to the front One thing you're gonna notice is I have my my tools So I have my fishing pliers right here uh, When I'm actually fishing I take this part and I stick it in there that way No water will hit my pliers and get them all rusted out um, Additionally, I have my stringer and the stringer actually doubles as a pull cord. I have a poker pole. This pole allows me to, you know, when I'm out in the water, I can actually get out there and I can tie off my stringer to my cord. That way I can be hands-free and my, my cart won't get away from me. If you guys come on in here, I'll show you. This is the cool part here. I have, uh, come around to this side. I have a live well system. And this is a basic strap that I have strapped in here. It can, re it can be removed. And I have a, a small aerator. And this is for if I decide that I want to get shrimp or guys take a look inside there. All this is is a Tide bottle, a Tide container, and it's a $4 aerator that I have set up. Here I have this. Uh, I have it strapped down with some bungee straps. Okay. Uh, I have a couple Plano boxes for whenever I'm out fishing. I have a waterproof container here, and this is so that I can, here's my fish duel card, but this is basically so I can put my phone, my keys, my wallet, whatever I need at the time, and it's waterproof. It's not going to get wet, all right? So if you look to the back here, I have a cup holder. That's just so that my water doesn't get tossed around in there. What, I, what I'm what i really excited about is I got a little mesh bag with my snacks, guys. Yeah, everybody has to have good fishing snacks when you're out there on the water. All right, so um, you can put whatever you want to put in yours, but that's what I put in mine, okay? Now, one thing you'll notice is I have these tie-down straps on both sides, and that's so that I can attach to the cart. This cart is basically all PVC. I have some tires. I have a rod running through there. And what I'll do is I'll attach the cart. So basically I have these uh, quick tie downs and I have a couple cleats on each side. I'll just strap it on that side. Come around on this side guys. Strap it to this side. Got my old T-handle. Now I'm ready to go. So in conclusion, this is the cart. Everything is set up. It's lightweight and it's ready to go. 